I'm Jamie Gillenwater, and I will be leading an InDesign for Technical Communicators webinar at 4 p.m. Eastern Time on March 21st. Before my webinar, I wanted to show you just one quick feature so you could begin to see the capabilities of InDesign. Today, I'll walk you through creating paragraph styles. The first way to create a paragraph style is by setting up your text as you want it, then creating a style based on that text. To do this, we first need to select our text tool and then click and drag to create a text box and then type your text in there. I'm just gonna type heading as place filler text and then you can select your typeface, adjust the font size. If you wanna add any other type options, you can do that up here. And then you want to open your paragraph styles panel there's three different ways to do this. You can go to Window, Styles, Paragraph Styles. You can go to Type, Paragraph Styles. Or as you can see here to the right of that option, it shows you your shortcut, which is F11. Within the Paragraph Style panel and with my text highlighted, I can select from the drop down menu, New Paragraph Style. As you can see, this pulls in all of the characteristics that we've assigned to this text. And then you can name it. I'm just going to name it Heading 1. Name it whatever is going to help you and your coworkers know when this style should be used. And then I'm going to select Apply Style to Selection. And OK. As you can see, with this text highlighted, Heading 1 is selected. Now, the other way to create a paragraph style is directly in your paragraph style panel. You're going to go back up to the drop down menu, choose new paragraph style. We don't want to apply this to any selected text and we're just going to name it body text. We don't want this based on any other font style, or paragraph style rather, and we're going to assign it some basic character formats. You can choose your font and your font size. I like to add some space after each paragraph so that it's easy to tell when a new paragraph is starting. You can also adjust your tabs, hyphenation, color, and more. If we go back up to our general options, we can see what options we've selected. So this is a nice summary of the style settings. And then we can select OK. As you can see, body text is now an available paragraph style. I like to order my paragraph styles based on hierarchy, um, but you can sort it alphabetically here by name, or you can just click and drag and place them in the order that's going to work best for you. Now to apply this new paragraph style to some text, I still have my text tool selected, and I just want to draw another text box, and I want to fill it with placeholder text, so type with the placeholder text. Easy enough, right? I'm going to select all of that text, click paragraph style, and you'll see it changed my font, the size, and added the space between the paragraphs. I hope you will join me to learn more about InDesign for Technical Communicators.